Welcome back everyone, today we have the Evolution Tins, these are the Vaporeon, Jolteon and Flareon Tins with Evolving Skies in there. So, first of all get your guesses in which one's going to get the best pulls, which one's your favourite as well. I think mine's going to be Jolteon, I think I've got a feeling that's going to win. I've opened up the seals already just to make it a bit easier, uh, but let me get the packs out and uh, yeah we'll get into this. So, first Flareon, we'll see which one has the best one, so here's a promo card for Flareon. Tell me which one's your favourite, which one do you think is going to win? Flareon can go over there on the right. Uh, we have a code card here, so someone can go and claim that. Go ahead. That's cool. And then the four packs are... Here we are. We can show you, slowly show you. Volley Skies, Chilling Rain, Battle Styles, and Sword and Shield Base Set, which are not bad packs, then. Not bad. All right, let's just stick this on the floor and get into the next one. Okay, right. The next one we have is Jolteon, so I assume it'll be the same packs as well. These are the packs for Flareon. Let's just put that in front, just to make sure we don't lose it. There is Jolteon. Let's have a look at that promo card. That looks really nice. That looks really nice. Um, another code card, so go ahead and claim that. It should just be the promo this year we get. And the four packs, which is, yep, standard. Yep, 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 yep. All good. Okay. So nothing weird about that one either. You never know, sometimes you might get like two Evolving Skies, I don't know. That would be, be much nicer, I think it, it should have been two Evolving Skies. If it was evolving, two Evolving Skies, one Chilling Rain and one Sword and Shield base, that would have been awesome. But here's a, here's a Vaporeon one as well. Kind of odd that it didn't have that, I mean, when we look at like the V-Striker tins from last year, um, or earlier this year anyway, with Battle Styles. It had two Battle Styles in there as well, and uh, same with the Chilling Rain ones. We had two Chilling Rains. I think we had tins for that anyway. But same packs again, and uh, yeah, there we are. So, get your calls in. Which one do you think is going to win? And uh, before we get into that, I do want to showcase the alternate arts. So the alternate arts I have in Japanese. We have the flurry on here. Really cosy looking. So that can go in front. Let's do it that way instead, eh? Let's do it that way. We have the Jolteon here as well in the city. That looks incredible. That one can go there. And Vaporeon, Coral Reef Vaporeon. So that looks much nicer, doesn't it? So these are actually coming out in English very, very soon, I think. Well, not very, very soon. In December, I think it is. And uh, they'll get their own boxes with the VMAX ones as well. So let's get into this Flareon one first. With the VMAX Ultimate Arts as well. I think it's going to be like six packs in there. So, I mean, it'll be nice. It'll be nice to open those. It'll be nice to get the promo cards as well. Um, the alternate arts. Only way to get it in English will be that way. Fire energy to start for Flareon, eh? What, what are the chances? Eh? Vigoroth, Lombre, Pikachu, Punky Boot, Rufflet. So, remember, we need alternate arts, but anything will be nice. Sableye and Shift Tree Hot Non Hollow. We've seen too many of those. Too many of those. Right, Chilling Rain. Uh, Brawly is the one that we've got four times. Four times we pulled Brawly for that. I don't want Brawly anymore. Last time we actually opened up a Chilling Rain product was, um, uh, was it the Calyrex boxes? And we got a Brawly there. I mean, come on now. What are the chances? Um, so hopefully we don't get that. Oh, in any alternate, again, there's about 12, I think, or 13 alternates in this set. So uh, let's see. Chroma is Chromable and a Zeb Striker. So nothing in that one. Flareon so far has. Absolutely nothing. Battle styles. Um, underrated set for me personally because we did pull three of the ultimate arts in our first three openings, which was incredible. Um, including the, whoops, there was a code. Um, including the Urshfu VMAX single strike ultimate art in our first, first pre-release pack. So it was absolutely crazy. Um, so that's why I think I, I like Battle Stars a lot, and then plus Empoleon Ultimate was beautiful, and we have the Tyrannus Ultimate in my collection now as well, in DD and Lurantis. That was odd because that was. If you look at this, this is the Coke off Battle Stars, you see that there. That's white. And you've got non hollow. What is this? What is this? Hey, return these tins. Return these tins. Um, a big shout out to Endo Collect. Um, his shop is amazing. He's a great guy as well, and um, he's actually in our Discord. So. If you want to talk to him, he's quite active in that, and uh, he's got a great shop and great packaging, etc. So please give him uh, give him some love. His uh, his store will be in the description, and please join our Discord and, and come join the community as well. And um, 
it's good for community to, to to be to be in really and um there'll be a link will be in the description as well pikachu very nice pikachu actually i've not seen that much um here you want to get the gold dogs i guess and four non-hollows in a row so nothing for flareon absolutely nothing hopefully jolton can do better let's see eh? let us see um i hope yeah it's unlike oh god I say that and, and we see see that green code card that means a non hollow for evolving skies as per usual um but i hope you enjoy some of the japanese openings I'm, i've been doing some sun and moon era, era ones uh, we had night unison and also ooh, i can't remember four metal ball i think were the ones we opened up this week go check them out uh, next week will be sky legends and ooh, we've got something no we don't trip of course we don't, it was a green code pack. It was uh, Sky Legends and, oh, I'm forgetting, I'm forgetting, oh, the other one we opened, GGN, so that's the Dark of Maturitina one. Some nice pulls, it was uh, interesting openings. Uh, Japanese openings don't really do that crazy well on my channel, I feel, but always nice. I mean, oh god, what have I done? That was a bad, okay, I'm sorry about that. It was, it was a non hollow anyway. I don't, where's a, what? Where's my energy? That's an error pack again. Great. So no energy in this one, which is always great. Um, all right. <laughs> That's why the, the, the card trick was wrong. Okay. All right. So, I mean, battle styles then. So uh, these aren't great tins so far. I'm not selling them very well, am I? You never know, though. It can change. It can all change. Right. Four cards from the back. Dark energy. I will actually open up a shiny star V-Box. Um, to end the series of Japanese boxes, uh, Frillish, Zubat, Grumpig, Reverse, Uncommon, and non hollow non hollow Sword and Shield, can you give us something? We've actually pulled the Rainbow Marnie twice, once on the channel, which is nice. Um, I think the actual full art Marnie is probably better, but Rainbow Marnie can't go wrong with. Um, here's a code card. Let's get into this one. Psychic energy, so the card trick actually worked this time. That means we have an energy, which was really weird. Okay, some error packs in this. Uh, Rookie D, what we have? Rhyhorn, Scrooppy, another non holo. Are you kidding me? That is eight packs, all non hollows. It's all up to very poor. It literally it needs and it needs a hollow and it will win. Sylvia artwork, see, that's a uh, nice evolutions there. And uh, let's see what we can get. These um, tins have been fairly awful, fairly, fairly awful so far. Um, I've seen some people get some crazy good luck from the tin, so clearly it's just me and my bad luck lately. Uh, maybe we're just saving all that good luck for celebrations. It's only two weeks away. Pet Lil, Pikachu, Rescue Carrier, and Myotech non Holo. So Evolving Skies hates us as, as usual. I mean, we saw the ETBs in the background. Speaking of ETBs, I will be doing uh, ETB battle with no real roots on twitch go check him out his link will be in the description as well and uh, i will post the is chilling rain code there i will post the actual video on demand afterwards as well so hopefully we can all watch it chest plate flaffy porygon swirx sneasel snova blitzel Click clear on reverse rare, and hey, we have a hit. It's uh, Calyrex V. So, so far, I mean, I mean, no, Vaporeon's one with one hit. Congratulations, Vaporeon. Nice. Yes, uh, congratulations. Big, big congrats. It was a tough battle, but Vaporeon came through. Um, if you're in the Discord, please do not bring up the copy paste of Vaporeon. I will ban you. Um, so, there's a battle styles code as well, and. Uh, I fully expect to get absolutely nothing from this, but let's see, let's see. We've got that one pull of the whole video. So this is an amazing video, everyone. Hope you enjoyed it. Cherubi, it's a Lazar Reverse Rare, nice, and it's Ender Scorch non holo uh, Yeah, amazing, amazing. It's down to this last pack of magic. Um, can we at least get something good or maybe not? I don't know. Otherwise, Endo, I'm going to have to return this whole tin. These have been opened, but that's fine. You can just really see all them or something. I don't know. Maybe they are. No, <laughs> no Endo's amazing. Go, like I said, go check them out and join the Discord as well. Vitality Band, Haunter, Chinchel, Baltoy, Cufant, 
Rookie, Grookey, Yamper, Krabby, and Stonjano. So that is 11 non hollows from 12 packs. One hit to review. I mean, let's just look at the alternates again. You know what? It's Cadarex V. Yay. Okay, bye. Which one's your favourite? Vapor um, Flareon, Jolteon, or the Fallen Over Vaporeon? Let me know in the comment section. And uh, well, hope you enjoyed. Leave a like, subscribe if you can. Bye bye.